This iPhone 13 has been taken to both Apple and you break I fix and both have reported that it has a dead motherboard. My first diagnostic step is to expose the motherboard and use my DC power supply probe to observe the amp draw when I tell the phone to boot. In this case it looks like we're getting just very small amperage spikes. These types of spikes can indicate a power rail short, so I'm going to check around NAND first and see if any of those lines are possibly short. This is the easiest spot to check because it's already exposed and easy to access. So I'll take my multimeter and measure the different lines. Good. Good. Short. So this line was good and this line was bad. This is my 2V6 line so I can inject 2.6 volts into it and see which capacitor heats up. One of them is short. So I'm going to keep my eye out on this one just because it looks discolored and it looks like there's some flux or something coming from it. So that's probably the culprit. With my DC power supply set to two, once I touch this with voltage, the shortage component should heat up. There it is, just as I suspected. Now when I measure with my multimeter again, we can see the line is no longer short. And when I test with my DC power supply probes, I should see a normal amperage draw. So power button, already looking much better. And this looks like it's booting now. And I got it working.